in this edition of Old School Cool, how Bram Stoker helped make Castlevania. Castlevania is one of the more iconic series in gaming. Spanning decades, gracing different consoles, and thrilling different generations of gamers. The games generally tell similar stories. A member of the Belmont family is tasked with taking down Dracula. And while one can trace the lineage of Dracula to one 19th century writer, that's just the beginning of the similarities between the original Castlevania and Bram Stoker's Dracula. Born in 1847, Bram Stoker was an Irish theater manager and author based out of London, best known today for his 1897 gothic novel, Dracula. His novel was appreciated by critics, but did not sell well, and Stoker died in 1912, known best as actor Sir Henry Irving's right-hand man. It took several movie adaptations, Nosferatu in 1922 and Universal's 1931 Dracula, for the character to become iconic. The stakes weren't as high for developer Konami when Castlevania debuted on the NES in 1986, but much like Stoker's book, it took a while for the franchise's commercial appeal to mirror its critical. A tough-as-nails action game, critics loved Castlevania, but it was hardly flying off of shelves. Luckily, it did well enough to earn two sequels. Still, it took over a decade for the series to become a commercial hit. 1997's Castlevania Symphony of the Night is widely considered one of the best games ever, and it was one of the better-selling PlayStation titles that year, and sales got better with time. Konami doesn't currently have plans for a new title in the series, but Netflix continues to produce a popular anime adaptation. Besides the delayed appreciation for Stoker's work and Castlevania, there are other franchise similarities. While both iconic, neither are the first at what they did. Vampire fiction predated Stoker's work by at least 200 years, and Castlevania was not the first video game to draw inspiration from horror. What the two franchises did do, however, was lean heavily into the adventure that can come from monsters. Both feature burly heroes equipped to take down Dracula, Van Helsing in Stoker's work, and Simon Belmont in Castlevania. So while Castlevania draws inspiration from Stoker's work in very obvious ways, the similarities between the two run much, much deeper than character adaptation. 